call a video to show you lot. Man never stop spending money on Kyle in it. I was gonna do a reaction video to this little clip. It's so short, but you know, let me just run the thing and then I'm just gonna talk on it afterwards. And don't get it twisted. Man's not with the hype. Oh, this video's trending. Let me jump on the wave and make a reaction video to it. Nah. I saw this video today. Come to find out it's like six months old and that. I saw it in one of them Instagram blog pages and that. Man never stopped spending substantial amounts of money on Gyal. I'm just gonna run the thing for you now anyway. Mama, shorty got me all the way up. So let me let me explain to y'all. Let me let me explain to y'all the story. I flew this way from Mom, Indiana, you know what I'm saying? Been talking to her on Instagram for months. You feel me? I done spent damn near five G's on this. She talking about she don't want nobody to touch her. Man, you got me up. You mean when you can leave? First of all, hold on, hold on, hold on. I man. First, she talking about she don't even fly spirit, right? Talking about she don't fly spirit. No. Like, like, she, like, you know, okay, so I get her mother. Exactly. So I get her mother Delta. That's damn near six, seven hundred last minute, right? Okay. So plus her bags, check in, all that shit. We go get her the Uber, all that shit. Then I'm damn near at two G's already. So we get here. First night, I'm being, a, I'm being a whole gentleman. I'm being a whole gentleman. Have you not? Have I not been a gentleman to you, though? Have I not done anything? Yeah. But you should have knew what it was if I f***ing flew you out here, no, though. I don't have if I don't want to. Why come out here, then? What do you mean? Why so, y'all, this is the Instagram model. You know what? I ain't gonna even be no petty ass. Put your name on there like that. Because you're recording me. Okay, so why the would you come halfway across the country knowing you didn't want to f*** on that? You, though. I ain't say you I did. You know what it was, time. though. You know what it was. You want to spend money. That's I spent f***ing five G's on you. What are you talking about? That's what you Five G's. What you talking about? So look, she did it. Hold on, let me talk. Shut up. Shut up. Did we? So we we'll have to go eat, right? So Shawty tomorrow she hungry. So Shawty, call him, call him, call him. Pack all this shit. I'll help you. I'll help you leave. Pack all this bum shit up. Pack all this shit. Pack all that shit up. It's not even about the. It's not even about. The, it's really about the money because it ain't about nothing. You feel me? It ain't about nothing. So listen. We get off the f***ing fight. Let me tell the story. We get off the f***ing fight. Okay. So I'm like, uh, you know, we went back to the room. Well, she's like, I'm hungry. I'm like, all right, well, let's, see, let's go to a little restaurant or something. You know, I'm trying to get her something to eat. She's like, oh, no, I only eat the best. I want some crab legs. That's another. So we go to the restaurant. I spend damn near ordering steak, motherfucking crab legs. The most. I'm buying all that shit, though, being a pure gentleman. You know what I'm saying? Being a pure, being a real So I spent damn near five G's on this already. Who you want to? You can leave. Yeah, I'm you can go. go. Yes, yes, I'll help you. Pack this yes, shit up. You can get the I'm all out. out. Get all your no, shit. Pack like all it. Here. It's already packed. Yeah, he's yes. He's Tell him how much money I spent, though. Tell him how much money I spent. Uh, I can get some. It ain't, it ain't enough for me to call. I got another coming through. I got another coming through. I got another coming through. So you can leave. You can get the out. Get your shit. Get your shit. It is. Been here two days. Two days talking about all my money touching me. Ain't no her period, none of that. None of that. Put your shoes on. I ain't on a period, nothing. What you do? You gonna work me? She gonna beat me up? Please, come on now. Get your goofy ass out of here. You got me all the way up. All right. Like, you better chill. Like, you know, something don't really get on your ass for that. Can you get the out? 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 Can you get the? I can get my way any day, baby. This that money, nothing, baby. I hope that five G's was worth it. Okay. Wait, man. You look, y'all put your Instagram on here, y'all. We keep talking. I'm gonna tell everybody what your Instagram is. Yes, please leave. Get the out. Bye. 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 Why are you recording me? Bye. 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 Get back home. Catch y'all at Uber. Where you going? You leaving over? Don't worry about where I'm going. Don't worry about where I'm going. Okay. Bye. Don't bum ass out of here. Boy, where do I start, fam? Where do I fucking start, fam? My man's made so many mistakes, it ain't even fucking funny, fam. That would never happen to me. You think I would ever be able to tell a story about me spending five grand, let alone 500 pound on a gyal? I'm basically coming off empty handed, if you understand what I'm trying to say. My man's made so many mistakes, it's not even a joke. I get it. Certain man, they got it, they're deep with it, I get it. I see his wrist. I see a little pinky ring in that. His wrist is looking bad though. I like the, I like that watch still. That pinky ring, you get it, he's looking hard still. Even if you've got it like that, fam, don't spend the money on these gab. Tell you what. I first clocked like years ago. This before man was watching all these red pill and 
get any kind of videos on that. Gyal will lie down with one guy for free and make a next man take her out on all these dates and not give him nothing, you know, dog. Must have linked up with one gyal, met on their dating sites and that. Get me. Took her to one pub around the corner, spoke to it for an hour, came back to the yard. You understand what I'm trying to say? My girls got up, yeah, talking about, yeah, I might go out on a date in a couple of hours' time. I'm thinking, what? I'm like, rah. Nah, no, she ain't gonna get me. I mean, you never know. Yeah, she might have two rounds, you get me in the same. You understand what I'm trying to say, innit? Yeah, but more than likely, it ain't gonna be that. I'm thinking like, rah, girl will lie down with one guy for free. He don't have to do nothing. He's good enough as is. But the next man, he's going to have to work for it. He's going to have to take her out on dates and that. He's going to have to chat to her every day for three months and that. Just to get a, a kiss on the cheek and that. Man, they need to stop spending money on these girl. You know why? That same girl will allow that guy to spend five bags, ten bags, fifteen bags, whatever in it, yeah, and give him nothing. There's some guy that is either smashing it for free or has smashed it for free, bro. That's how man think. I'm not investing nothing into none of these girl. If you do take a girl out on a date, keep it cheap. Come on, man. You must have heard girls say, listen, I don't care where a guy takes me and that. It's all about the guy. It's all about the experience and that. When she said experience, it's not about experiencing the food. Just good conversation and that. Girls don't... Obviously, there are girls out here that, yeah, you need to take me to Tashi, so lock on all them places there. I get in here, yeah, but fam, forget them girls. I've already made videos about there's certain girls I've never did. There's certain girls out here that expect to be taken to lock on. I think they've closed that place that's like Ambedda Terrain, but it's one of them places, you know, like Tashi, so people go there to take the pictures and that. There's certain girls out here, or they want to go Nova Cole, this is what the Hakasan, all these places. I've never been there before. I've been Lockham and Tashis, but them other places there where you're spending £150 a meal and all them things there. I've never been there. There's certain girls out here, they expect to be taken to those places, you know, on the first date. No, I will not date that type of woman ever because I don't know where it's going to go. Girl will literally. Be banging a man for free and making the next man pay. I know, man. Man that I know told me that they've been dealing with one girl. And you get me, they're smashing it. And the thing's got a boyfriend. He ain't getting nothing from it. Yet still, she wants to buy my guy clothes and give him, not money, but you get me, clothes and accessories and them things. And I think you're like, bro, this, this. No way, fam. No way, fam. Blood, you don't need to spend money on these girls. Don't need to spend money on these girls. But you know what? You see a man like that? Yeah, I don't feel sorry for a man like that, you know. If this was five, ten years ago, yeah, all right. Man don't, man don't know the game like that because most men ain't that experienced with girl to really understand female nature and that you have to learn it from man that's really experienced with girl, innit? But... If this was five, ten years ago, fine, innit? Yeah, you might be able to... I'll give him a little pass and that. I, I would not be spending them five grand and five hundred pound and that on a girl. Don't get it twisted, innit? Yeah, but like, blood, there's no excuse to be getting finessed like that nowadays, fam. There's too many different red pill contents and that. There's too much different dating courses and that. You should not be getting finessed by a girl like that. You're dumb. The reason why I don't feel sorry for a man, because I know a man's probably seen them videos there and think, like, dickhead use. I know, man. Man, I said to me years ago, what, you watch them dating videos? Yeah, 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 man, watch them dating videos. Man, understand the psychology of females. Man cannot get finessed. I'm not saying man got finessed before in the past, but definitely not now, fam. It ain't happening. It ain't happening. I know, gyal. Man, I try to set me up with, you get me, gyal. And I know... That this particular girl has banged someone that I know without a date. So naturally, this was years ago, you know, six years ago, seven years ago, something like that. Naturally, I know I'm not taking this girl on a date because she is beatable without having to take 
take her out to wine her and dine her and that. So therefore, why am I taking her out and wine and dine her when someone else that I know has got it? And I regard, regard myself as higher level than this guy. So I definitely ain't spending no money on this fucking girl. You must be nuts. Not doing it, fam. These girls will play you, blood. Will play you. <laughs> They'll make you take them out on five dates. Chat to them every day for six months and that, and then ghost you with the real guy that they want comes along. I remember one time, I me, mean, I don't play about. I remember one time I went to one girl shot for the first time ever in it. And obviously, I told her that, yeah, I might have to go somewhere like within the next couple hours and that when I first arrived. True stories. But it weren't certified. I needed to go and do something. It weren't certified in it. Man. Remember, I'm sitting down with a girl. Get me. Man's trying to, you get me, make her move and that. And she's, uh, yeah, putting the brakes on and that. Oh, you know what, yeah? Like, oh, yeah, my man's hit me up. You know, I'm going to have to go in like 10 minutes and that. When I saw that, that the girl's not, that cut, uh, skirt, I'm gone, fam. I'm not hanging around, blood. Why am I even wasting any of my time, fam? And that's a girl's yard that I went to that's just not too far away from, man. You understand? I'm not, I'm, I'm not flying to her. I definitely ain't flying her out and paying all this money and that. Like, fam, come on, blood. Like, you know, my mum watches some of my videos now, ain't it? Yeah, so get me. Man, I have to be a bit more uh, diplomatic at that. You understand what I'm trying to say? Anymore? But blood, like, it, <laughs> let's say, for example, I was dumb enough to spend five grand flying a girl out. And I know it weren't just five grand for the flight, but you get me. But anyway, let's just say I was dumb enough to spend money on a girl and fly her out. And that. before man planned to fly her out and that, and you get me, I would say to her, like, fam, you got to know how to ask things in a way where, I mean, I'm a man. I'm direct and upfront. But do you know what? Yeah, certain times yeah, there's a way to say things, isn't it? Yeah. So I would say, you get me, like, when I'm planning this little trip for her to come check, man, or whatever, because obviously, I'll, let's say I'm in a situation where I'm paying and that, yeah, you know, it ain't that time of month, is it? You understand what I'm trying to say, isn't it? Yeah, like, that's what, that's what man will be trying to get me. I'm going to convey that message that, yeah, it, it, that, that's what man's looking for, isn't it? Like, come on, man, you're just stupid, like, you think I'm, shoot. You think you think I'll be out here spending four or five grand, whatever in here, how much hundreds of pounds or thousands of pounds and that to not get nothing, fam. Yo, man, I'm certifying that beforehand, look. But do you know I wouldn't even be spending their money there in the beginning. I just won't deal with no girls that I feel like I need to spend that type of money on. No way. No way, no way, no way. But I don't feel sorry for them, man, because like I said. There's plenty of, you know, dating coach videos and red pill videos and that. You should not be getting finesse and that. You should not have a girl using you like that. That's dumb. That's dumb. I know, man. M man had told me, like, blood, I drove all the way to a different part of London, man. And the girl didn't want nothing, you know. Like, oh, she didn't want me to touch her. And, uh, yeah. What? Nah, fam. Nah, fam. And that's nothing. That's just a little trip over there. It's like, a man told me that he went to a girl's yard and you get me, he tried to make a move on her and she just said, ah, oh, you know, I just want to talk and that, innit? He told her, and I would have said the exact same thing, well, why don't you just call me then? Why don't we just talk on the phone? Why do I have to drive all the way down to you just to talk? Next man I know, you get me, he went to go and check a ting. Well, I think the ting came to him and that. The girl slept with her jeans on, you know, in the bed, you know. Who the fuck sleeps with jeans on in the bed? And she wanted to make it as difficult for you as possible. That is not happening to me. I'm not spending no five grand. I ain't spending no big boy money on no girl for her to uh, tell me, nah, nah, nah. Fuck that bullshit, man. Fuck that bullshit. Keep the dates cheap. If a girl is not willing to go out for a couple of drinks at a little bar and that, uh, if she's not willing to do that, fam, she don't like you, fam. She don't like you because always remember, there's some guy... I can get it for free. I've been with man. I've been with man on a night out. Randomly. We're just out, you know. He's drawn a ting. Couple hours later, he's beat the ting, fam. You know, there are some guys who are actively dating that girl at that same time, you know. 
paying for all these dates and that. Because the girl was decent. The girl was nice, isn't it? I know there's plenty of men who are probably taking this girl out on dates and that. Talking to her on the phone for hours. You get me really running some real deep game on her and that. To get nothing. For some random guy to come along on one random night. Whisper a couple words to her and yeah, next you know he's got a back at one yard and that. Forget that blood. Man, they need to stop spending money on these gal out here, man. They're not worth it. They would not spend the money on you, fam. So why would you spend the money on them? Keep the dates cheap. If you know a gal, you're chatting to a gal, and you, you get me, like, you ain't get me got to that level, innit, yeah, with her. Fam, just keep the dates cheap, blood. It's up to you, fam. Like, obviously, once you get there and you're establishing your proper date in the thing, then, yeah, if you want to spend money, that's up to you, innit? I still won't do it. But definitely beforehand, fam, you need to keep your date cheap because gal will use you, fam. Girls will go out on dates with guys knowing full well that they have no intentions with sleeping with them all because they want a break from their boyfriend and they just want to take their mind off of him. They'll have you spending £200. They'll have you talk to them every night for a whole fucking week. Just because they want a break from their boyfriend. What do you think, fam? Any of you man that use these dating apps, any of you man like draw gal on roll them that, and you can't get up with them, like you got the girl's number, you're chatting to them, but you can't get out on a date with them. I told you why you can't get out on a date with them, because they want a break from their boyfriend, or they got a boyfriend, but you get me, he ain't showing her too much attention, so she needs external validation, so she will use you for free dates and free validation, blood. Get your hopes up. Don't do it, fam. But anyway, man, that's it, man. Man's up. Stay wise. Done, man.